The world got another key message on inter-Korean relations from the South Korean president today. His narrative consistent with previous ones. The Moon administration will take all necessary measures to bring eventual peace on the Korean peninsula. Moon Gwan Young has the highlights from his speech at two major venues. The darkest hour of all is just before the break of dawn, said South Korean President Moon Jae-in as he acknowledged the critical situation vis-a-vis -vis North Korea and reassured that despite all, there will eventually be peace and prosperity on the Korean Peninsula. Speaking to leaders of the Presidential Advisory Council at the Presidential Blue House on Wednesday, the new South Korean leader urged Chaired by the South Korean president himself, the council established in 1981 and boasts 19,000 members from over 120 countries and offers the president policy advice on reunification of the two Koreas. That message was echoed by Mr. Moon earlier in the day as he made a speech before a group of overseas Koreans representing South Korean communities abroad. He noted the increasing tensions in and around the Korean Peninsula and vowed that their home country is doing its best to fundamentally resolve North Korea's nuclear issue. We have to go to the peace. It is a long way, but it is a long way to go to the peace. It is a long way to the South Korean president then put on his honorary ambassador cap. Moon Gonyong, Arirang News.